think about all this cross business. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Have you found anybody that don't love it yet? Yeah, well, no, I had. I, 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 who was that? Somebody was telling me, you know, it was some folks that read, actually didn't want it, though. It went, they didn't tell me who they were. But. Well, there's always going to be. Who? There's always going to be somebody. From, uh, I can't imagine. I mean, well, you know, folk more bold than they used to be. Even if some folk didn't want it, it used to be you'd be shaving and tell somebody right. you didn't want it. Right, you know? they speak right up. Yeah, they don't right. care now. They'll tell, they'll tell anybody. They don't care. They don't, they don't care at all. That's right. That's why we got, we got to speak up, too. <laughs> yeah, a couple of weeks ago, you know, the cross is beautiful. I think it's put through it. It makes a statement to people that can be seen a long ways away. And I, I am glad to see it here. Now, what's your name? Arnold. 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 You are you are a deacon at I'm a deacon at the Church. Yeah, and y'all take undertaking the, the, the cross there, or that project that Arnold has started in. What you think about that? Is that a good thing? It's a good testimony. Good testimony. Yeah. Yeah. And, you know, people traveling through here. Yeah. I mean, like Arnold told a story about some guy from down the river mm -hmm. seen the cross. Yeah. That made him start wanting to go back to church. Mm -hmm. That's what it's all about. That's good. Yeah. So you proud to be a part of that? Yes, sir. I am. Yeah. I'm, really, I'm real proud of the church. Yeah. Well, thank God. But, but thank you. But thank you, brother. Uh, You're right. Here with Mrs. Bonita Perry, uh, counselor at the Jabba uh, Treatment Center yes. in Adamsville, Tennessee. Yes. Uh, have you noticed the cross? Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, you can't miss it. You can't, can't miss it. It's been there for years too, but it's yeah. been completely refurbished. How do you feel about that? Um, well, I like it. I mean, I think, you know, like when you pass by and you see it and I think it's supposed to be lit up now, right? Yeah, it is. Yeah, okay. Well, I haven't seen it lit yet, uh -huh. but I think even without it being lit, you it know, it was just place. a, yeah, yeah. yeah it's yeah. a symbol I, and, I, and that's what it is. Yeah. It's a symbol of hope. And I think when people see it, you know, it's just a, you know, make them think, you yeah. know, hope, salvation. Yeah. So I think, and I can't wait to see it lit up. I just yeah, can't, it's lit can't up wait. there and it changes colors, LED lighting. It actually, it's a beautiful, it's a beautiful sight, but it always has been. Even oh, like yeah. you said, even oh, yeah. when it ain't lit, it, it's a reminder. Right, exactly. Yeah. So yeah. yeah, I love it. I love it. So you yeah. think it's a positive thing for the area, for Crump, Savannah, yes. and for anybody that pays yes, that way? for anybody. And you never know when yeah. they see it mm -hmm. because you never know what a person is going through. That's true. So when they see it at that moment. Even if they're not a believer or not a Christian, it'll still take them to. Yeah. Yeah. It'll make them think it's, it'll it's make our think. It, the, the cross is our Christian symbol. Yeah, exactly. And even if they don't believe, they got the record that. There just, you go. <laughs> I promise you. So it's a good thing. It's yeah. a wonderful thing. Okay. Well, yeah. thank you. So it, we 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 look. At, I know you go to church over there and back and forth. So you mm -hmm. see it many times. I see it every day. Every day. Yeah. <laughs> Praise so God. It's a beautiful thing. Thank you for yes. your time. Yes, sir. Yeah. Stacks at the. Freedom River meter. Peggy, what you think about the cross on the river there now? I think it's absolutely beautiful. We come through there at night, it turns blue and then red yeah. and then white and different colors and it is yeah. it's just beautiful. It catches your eye. Yeah. It's eye catching. And you come through there quite a bit, don't you? Yes, every night. Every night. <laughs> every night. <laughs> so you get a chance to look at sure and do. you could probably saw it before too, didn't you? When it was Yeah, yeah, I yeah. saw it before yeah. it didn't show up that pretty. Oh. Just, I mean it was pretty, but not yeah. like it's okay, it's well good. Now. So you think it's a good thing for the whole area? Oh yeah. I do. Okay, well, it, it catches your eye, like I said, I told my granddaughter the night. You know, somebody comes across to there is not safe, they're mm -hmm. gonna see that cross and you know, they're gonna know what that cross represents. Yeah, that's so true. Well thank so, you, Peggy. We well, I, I think everybody around here ought to be proud of that. Yeah, I do too. Right, thank you, Peggy. Really? That cross was? That's yeah, so you 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 be you kinda of glad to see it come back? Well of course. I'm glad to see it. We need all the help we get I in this world. Right. I know that's right. I know that's right. Man, what's your name? Peggy. Peggy. Mm -hmm. And your husband here, brother Jean. Y'all uh, been coming up here for what? 16, 16 years. 16 years. 16 years. Yeah, we're working off. We're getting ready to, to retire. Our, to retire. Yeah. Well, well, he took an early time, back in 91, from the aluminum industry. We don't have any kids. Mm -hmm. You know, so, but it's time now. He's 78, I'm 62, so it works, it's time for us to do our thing. But you're glad to see the cross come back. Definitely. It kind of says something about 
the whole area, don't we? Yes. And like I said, all of us can use all the help we can get. I know that's right. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> 16 years too? Oh, yeah. Huh? Yeah, more than that, really. Yeah, but you think that's a wonderful thing? Oh, no, it's absolutely priceless. think about the cross project? I think it's awesome. It is awesome. Hello. Yes, sir. Mr. Wayne Gerald, ADS. Stay right on the river at the cross there, so you see it all the time. I can see it from my house. From your house. What do you uh, think about that cross? Well, I think that's the most beautiful thing they've done for Crump or surrounding towns in a long time, and the way it's lit up, and mm -hmm. it's a, a, a testimony, you know, within itself. Yeah. And, yeah. Yeah, I can see it from my front porch if I go out at night, and it's a warm feeling. That's a blessing, man, and we thank you for, on this song, helping out on music. You've been all over, traveled all over, and you come over and help us out on this. Well, it's an honor to get to be with y'all, I'll tell you. <laughs> He's been with me, or I've been with him for about 40, 50 years now, and we've <laughs> crossed a lot of bridges but that's together. a blessing. Still I going, you know. We've got a lot to be thankful well you, you you're a wonderful musician excellent musician so we, you, we, 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 we we thank you for that and but that cross you think it you think it'll help other people that oh I went. think it will I think it's uh, you know it's it's so moving to look at it and if you don't stop and and think just a little serious yeah. then you don't have yeah. much to build to, you know <laughs> it's a uh, it, it's got so, so, so you glad yeah. they refurbished it and got it back oh, up and yes. going. I'm proud of it. Well, I'm well, I know you proud of it. You can walk in. You can walk see it from your house. You can see it <laughs> in the tavern. <laughs> uh, well, well, thank, thank, thank you uh, uh, so much for 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 everything you contributed to it, and well, we really appreciate it. It's nice meeting you and yeah. seeing Gerald again and yeah. being here and being a part of yeah. it. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Huh. My name's Mike Kelly. I live in Savannah. My wife, Dickie. Mm -hmm. Well, let me ask you this, uh, uh, Mike. The cross, with this, it's called the cross, the Crump Cross Project. Because uh, it's been down for a few years, but it's being refurbished as, as we speak. Uh, do that cross say anything to the passerbys? Do it mean anything to a community? Uh, I'm encouraged to hear this. That, uh, that somebody's working on it. Uh, you can't you can't leave Savannah and go to Adams without seeing it and and uh, you know, think about Jesus when you see that and and so uh, I think it can be a great witness to people that uh, need the Lord and, mm -hmm. and to those of us that are saved. It's a good reminder yeah. for us. So uh, I'm excited to hear the community is you know is interested in working on it a little bit. Yeah, and they're, re they're refurbishing it with uh, the state-of-the-art LED lighting, so I, I think we all understand it can change colors now. But do you think that when a person sees that cross, whether they say or unsay, do you think the cross, just seeing the cross, the symbol of the cross, take us to a certain place spiritually? Uh, I, think it, I think in today's society, it means different things to different people. Mm -hmm but it still forces them to think. And uh, you know, you gotta start with a witness to folks. And so I'm, I'm excited to hear about it. Now, well, I remember from years ago, and just coming through, didn't know who put it up, why I was there, but it will, it, it's a sight to remember, and it is a reminder. It, 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 will, it will take you to a sacred place in, in your heart. You know? It will. And it should, it should be uh, all the Christians in the area should be proud of it. Yeah, yeah. You know, and, uh, and sort of think about what the Lord did for them. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it'll, it'll help remind us. But thank, thank you, Mike. I, I know uh, now your business here is uh, what's the name? Yeah, it's Kelly's Catch, and uh, we've uh, we've been here a long time. And God's blessed our business, and uh, so we're we're thankful for what you're doing. Okay. Well, thank you so much for your time, and then uh, I'm just glad to meet your acquaintance, and, and thank you for your time. Share that. Okay. Bless your work. Uh -huh. I'm Pastor. I'm Pastor. I'm here with uh, Pastor Edward Perry uh, here at the Chamber Treatment Center, Treatment Center in Adamsville, Tennessee.
And also, uh, Pastor Perry, you passed the, the first church when you crossed the river. Yes. Uh, they're yeah. going into Savannah, Jabbok uh, uh, Refuge Center. That's right. Uh, Pastor Perry, uh, what do you think about the cross? They, they refurbished it and had, uh, they call it the cross, uh, cross project. It's been completely refurbished. All right. Yeah. But well, I, I, I liked it. I was coming across the bridge the other night and uh, when I topped the bridge coming from the church, I saw the light. I said, uh, first, my first thought was, what is that? And I recognized it was the cross. Um, I think it's good. Um, I think it's an attention getter. I think it's a reminder that, that, that Jesus is Lord. I think um, to the lost is hope. And to those who are not lost, uh, it's encouraging okay. uh, for us to look forward to his return. And with the work you do here at the treatment center here. I'm the, I'm the therapist here. I'm one of the therapist counselors. Uh, we are a treatment center. Uh, we treat opiate addicted uh, patients. Those well, I, I imagine with that though, there are some days you maybe uh, leaving Savannah or going to Savannah that there's some frustration. Oh, yeah. And when you see that cross, it kind of... Very good. careful. Very careful. Yeah. And, and whoever thought of the project Whoever had that project, I think it was I think it was God motivated uh, because um, the city needs to be reminded of who we are in Him mm -hmm. uh, because He died for all of us. Mm -hmm. And uh, I applaud um, the gentlemen um, and the group uh, organization who um, refurbished the, 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 the cross. Because it's down at the cross. I, that's my favorite song, favorite <laughs> hymn, Down at the Cross, when I first saw the light. And so uh, it reminded me when I first got saved. Okay. Uh, I, 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 I sing that every year. As a matter of fact, they have my anniversary, pastoral anniversary, every year, fourth Sunday in September. And I sing that hymn every year. Mm -hmm. And throughout the year, down at the cross. Okay, okay. Yes, well, Pastor Perry, I thank you for your time, man. And I. I, I, I know it, it, uh, one thing that the guy, uh, gentleman that uh, helped you know, the, 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 was kind of the spearhead guy to get him up there. He said he hoped it, he wanted to just be a sign and let folks know that the churches in Crump were open for business. But it's also letting them know the churches in Savannah are open for business. That's right. <laughs> and your church is the first physical That's right. church. That's right. That's right. When they cross the bridge going into Savannah, That's right. That's right. right there on the right, your church is actually the first physical church That's they get to. Right. And so, are y'all open for business? Yes, definitely. <laughs> Every Sunday morning at 9 a.m. and Wednesday night at 7 o'clock. Hey, Amen. Well, thank you, That's Pastor right. Perry. I'm so glad. Uh, uh, to, 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 to get your uh, opinion and expression about the cross and I hope it will take people to a special place whoever whoever get a chance to see it in the future uh, and thank you for your time thank, thank you uh, God bless you you said you moved here I moved here in 1996 mm -hmm. and uh, it wasn't up when we first moved up here mm -hmm. we moved up like right after that school year ended mm -hmm. So it was like uh, the summer of 96. Okay. So they were either just putting it in mm. and didn't have it all the way up yet, uh -huh. or it didn't go, in. but uh, yeah, it wasn't up when I first moved here. Okay, okay, so okay. It was like right after the summer. Right so so we talking about the later 90s then? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. Definitely so, second half of the 90s. Okay, okay. After all right. 96 and before 2000. Okay, all right, thank you there. Well, good. So you think it's a good thing that it's there? I think it's a good thing to say. Think it says something about Crump, the little area of Crump? Yeah, it's nice around here. I like it. It's quiet. I don't never have no trouble out here. Okay. Well, I seen them down there working. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember when they put it up. And you think that's a good thing? Yeah. Okay, good. It's a good thing. Yeah. Yeah. You come through Savannah on Highway 64, pass over the river. There's a sight for you to see. It stands there like a beacon. It's always 
shining bright to cross by the highway it lights up the night it has no words to speak it just stands there tall and proud but the message is clear silent but loud and the story is told about a man from Galilee who gave his life on the cross at a hill called Calvary The cross is a symbol of what happened long ago, a testament of love, so we will always know. It touches everybody down in their soul. Cross by the river on Highway 64. The cross is a symbol of what happened long ago a testament of love so we will always know it touches everybody down in their soul Cross by the river on Highway 64. It touches everybody deep in their soul. The cross by the river. On Highway 64